Italian stuffed mushrooms. And we're also going to throw in a garlic cream sauce that you're going to make really quick while this is in the oven. So join me around the corner and let's cook this thing. Let's start on the stove by sauteing the bacon and the Italian sausage, crumbling the sausage as it browns. Now we're going to add the chopped mushroom stems and the diced onions. Toss in the chopped tomato and the oregano. Next, add the crushed croutons and then stir to combine. And finally, add the chopped parsley. Then remove from the heat and allow to cool for just a few minutes. Now transfer the cool stuffing to a bowl and add the mozzarella cheese. Next, you want to add the uh, Parmesan cheese and combine. Get it thoroughly combined in there. Now begin to firmly stuff the mushrooms, mounding it up on top. You want to really kind of pack it in uh, really tight. Place the stuffed mushrooms in an oven-safe vessel, one that's been uh, sprayed or coated with uh, cooking, cooking spray or an oil. Continue doing this until all the mushrooms are stuffed. Fill your pan with all of the stuffed mushrooms. It's almost time to bake these things. All right, now we're going to place this into our preheated oven, and we're going to cook these for 15-ish minutes or so. Now let's make the cream sauce. First, you want to heat the cream and add the garlic. However much garlic you want is up to you. You know me, I like to squeeze it out of there, and that looks like, oh my goodness, about three cloves. Now reduce the cream to thicken and uh, season with salt and white pepper. I like me some white pepper. Continue to reduce until it reaches your desired consistency. Now, when it coats the back of a spoon and you can draw a line through it, we call that nappe. Now, let's go to the oven and take these mushrooms out of there. They're smelling delicious, I promise you. They, they really are. All right, this is hot. Take it out and uh, we'll get ready to plate. Now for a little garnish and extra flavor, let's grate some fresh Parmesan on top of the mushrooms using your uh, handy dandy micro plane. Now we're gonna get ready to plate by pouring the cream sauce to coat the bottom of the serving plate. This will give everyone a little bit of cream sauce on it and the ability to scoop up some more. So then uh, placing the mushrooms on top of the cream sauce, you can do it in a pattern or just how it fits. As you put them on there, that cream sauce will spread out over the plate. Continue until all the mushrooms are plated. Oh, this is looking so good. It really is. Now grab some of the goodies that are in the bottom of the pan and add it to the top of the mushrooms for a little extra pop of flavor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Now you have a gorgeous plate of scrumptious umami bombs. All right, my friend, it is my favorite time of the day, and that is tasting time. Look at these beauties. I'm so excited. Uh, so here we go. I'm going to take a couple. I'm going to go for that big one right in the middle. I put the cream on the bottom so that every time you pick it up, you get a little bit. You can always add a little bit more to the top if you want to, if there's not enough for your taste. But it allows everybody to get at least a taste of that. So I've got some nice size ones here. Let's get this thing tasted, my friend. Mmm. 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 That is so stinking good. I mean, that's really good. Absolutely fantastic. So, until next time, remember this. A day in the kitchen beats a day of working any day. We'll see you next time on the Chef Lance Show.